All right, let's play New Vegas Part Two, where I barely have even started. Got two videos out and haven't even started playing the game. Hopefully, I can get started this game. So, here's our character. That's where we left off last time. Guy, it's a Mexican, because they didn't have Indian. Oh well, that's fine. Mexican with facial hair. How about get the hair color to be something? Champagne. Looks good. Pretty decent. It's got that. It's got that gray yet sexy type feel. Got it. All right. Let's well, go. I got most of it right anyway. Stuff that mattered. Okay. No sense keeping you in bed anymore. Oh. Let's see if we can get any more. Oh my God. Doc Mitchell, what? What did you do to me while I was in? Good. When I was out gold. Why don't you walk down to the end Out of the cold. Over by that bigger tester machine there. Oh my Take it slow god. now. Oh god. It ain't a race. Oh, my butt hurts a little bit. Doc Mitchell. What did... What went on in this bed? Oh, a doctor's bag. Let me have that. Okay, vigor tester time. Looking good so far. Go ahead and give the vigor tester a try. We'll learn right quick if you get back all your faculties. Light switch. This is that is from the interior light switch mod. Actually, I did not introduce that mod in the previous mod video. Um, this this is for improved interior lighting or something like that, which basically adds a lot of light switches around it, the interiors of a lot of different um, buildings. I don't even know which one this is turning on and off. Cannot tell from here. Alright, that's fine. Let's go get the bigger tester started. Alright, so I kind of want my character to be... I was going to make my character a... A fist guy. So he's going to go straight up fisting everybody. If you get my drift. Um, and by fisting I meant... Punching people. So I guess he is charisma. I usually charisma. I always go with usually very high charisma. I even put like ten charisma on a couple of my characters because I just like talking to people and just you know talking my way out of stuff. But for this playthrough, let's make it interesting because I already know how to talk my way out of stuff. Intelligence, yeah, that's good. Decent intelligence. Agility, so yeah, decent agility too. Luck, luck is one thing that I always put down to like zero, because luck, basically, yeah, critical hits. Any, I mean, okay, all skills. Is, I guess that can be one thing, but um, kind of going for a specialization type of build. So I don't know. Critical hits. I guess that can be one thing that'd be good. I'll maybe leave three on here. No, I got two. Enemy mishaps. I, I don't even know what that is. I always have my luck all the way down to zero. So. I don't know, maybe like grenade just like blow up an enemy's hand or something, I have no idea. I'll leave that at zero. Alright. Um strength is good. I put good endurance, good strength. I'll be intelligent too. Hey, I'm brown. Gotta be intelligent. Oh you know what? I have to be intelligent. I gotta go fix around I'm the I am the final tech support person in all the wasteland. They're gonna need. They're gonna need a tech support guy. I mean, and who, what better? Who better to do your tech support guy? Seems to me you're the luckiest than me. I am reincarnated for this purpose. Ah, ye. Thank you. Come again. I have a terrible Indian accent. What do you say? You take a seat in my couch, and we go through a couple of questions. Doc Mitchell, can you um, can you please give me my clothes back? I feel a little. I feel a little uncomfortable. Like this. I mean, just think about it. You were shot in the head, and then you wake up, and this strange man has you, like, supposedly he's a doctor. Supposedly he's fixed you. But he won't give you your clothes until you sit down, have a nice long talk with him. I don't know. Seems a little fishy. All right, I guess I'll do what you say. All right, Doc Mitchell. Let's get started. All right. I'm going to say a word. I want you to say no. the first My eyes are up here. Doc. 
dog. I'm gonna kick the dog. House. Oh god. It's gonna be terrible. House burglarize. Night. Day. Oh no. Dream shroud. Hmm. Campfire. No, shroud. No sleep. Treasure. Silencer. Bandit. Oh, you know what? I should be I'm gonna be a super sneaky puncher guy. Unarmed. That's what I'm gonna do. Alright, bandit. I'm gonna crush him. Light. What would be heavy? Mother. Cookie jar. Okay. Now I got a few statements. I want you to tell me how much they sound like something you'd say. First one. Conflict just ain't in my nature. Dude, no way. I ain't given to relying on others for support. I don't rely on anybody. I'm always fixing to be the center of attention. I'd rather be in the dark. I'm slow to embrace new ideas. Nah, man, I love fires and wheels. I charge in to deal with my problems head on. That's true. Almost done here. What do you say you have a look at this? Tell me what you see. Upside down mushroom cloud. Uh, close enough. Okay. How about this one? Two guns pointed upwards. Some of these I have no idea how people can see them. How could this be a ship at sea? <laughs> Two bears, guys. Last one. Two bears high fiving each other. This is one of the ones that the whole Fallout community was super pissed off at that they didn't have this. This is so obviously. You got two bears. Look, the bear's nose, bear's eyes, bear's ear right there. There's two bears. Look at the bear's little tail thing and their legs. They're high-fiving each other right there. And then, I can't believe Obsidian didn't put that in. Two, it's so, like, rid ridiculously, obviously, two bears high-fiving each other. God damn it. I think there's actually some mod that adds that in there. Two bears high-fiving each other. Uh, Bearded Man. Mushroom Cloud. Uh, Bearded Man. Well, that's all she wrote. That's all she wrote. I don't have nothing to compare it to, so maybe you'd better just have a look oh, at the results. Oh, quick aside, you guys who listen to, it all seems right to you. a song called That's All She Wrote by Eminem, no, by T.I. featuring Eminem. Really good song. Uh, unarmed, yeah, definitely. I was going for unarmed, good. Science, of course. Why? Wow, this thing's a little darker, and it's definitely me right there. Melee weapons, I actually might put it into instead of melee weapons what should I put it into because mm. I want to just go straight up unarmed how about I do sneak yeah I'm gonna sneak sneak science and unarmed let's do it before I turn you loose I need one more thing from you you got a form for you to fill out so I can get a sense of your medical history just a formality Ain't like I expect to find you got a family history of getting shot in the head. Oh, God. It's gonna kill me. Oh, yeah, this is another thing. I think I added a bunch of these perks. Or these traits, I mean. Um, that's from one of the mods. I won't be the 21st with the big iron on my head. Oh, that's from the song. Uh, your agility is increased by one, but you take more critical damage from raiders. Is there anything about punching people? Melee damages. Uh, uh, I don't know, because I really want to go around punch- Oh, this one looks like- But less critical hit damage. Oh no, because I'm going to be sneak, so I want to- I want to sneak around and kill people. These ones, they, they really put like decent one, decent traits in here because like they, they all have like a good side, but they all have a downside too. So, receive a set of medical items at the cost of your karma. Hmm. Oh shoot, I'm running out of time again. I need to get used to this whole 10 minute time limit thing. Um, all right, so I guess we'll leave off right here. Next video will start with me. I've already picked. I'll, I'll pick the two and then I'll start up. So yeah, I will see you guys on part three.